The Adams Ground Fire update introduces mobile anti-aircraft guns for all factions. Refinements have been made to the gunplay experience. The US M301 half-track has received a new skin, backpacks have been removed from all characters, and some changes have been made to the town map. Named after the Medal of Honor recipient Lucian Adams, this update brings new tools to the infantry soldier's toolbox to deal with airborne threats. The US M16 multiple gun motor carriage is a mobile and versatile gun platform based on the M3 half-track chassis. Armed with four 50 caliber M2 Browning machine guns in a quad mount, this vehicle was extremely popular among the troops, who referred to it affectionately as the meat chopper for its overwhelming firepower. The M2 Mad Deuce machine gun combines a high rate of fire with a powerful 12.7mm round. Four of those pointed at the sky will make any pilot hesitate. The German Sonderkraftfahrzeug 7.1 with the Flugabwehrkanone 38 mounted in the back is an awe-inspiring vehicle. This mobile AA gun with the infamous flak feeling is a real powerhouse of destruction. The four 20mm quad-mounted autocannons do require a precise aim and conservation of ammunition because of their slower rate of fire and smaller magazine size. But the high explosive rounds are absolutely devastating once they hit their target. The Soviet gas AAA M4 Maxim trades immediate damage output for sustained fire capabilities. The vehicle is armed with four Maxim 1910 machine guns chambered for the standard Russian 7.62mm rifle cartridge. This reliable, water-cooled, short-recoil heavy machine gun has an extensive magazine which allows the gas AAA to provide a constant withering fire that can hammer even the most stubborn enemies into submission. Categorized as infantry support vehicles, the new mobile AA guns can be unlocked by infantrymen via the chauffeur combat ribbon. In other news, this update also incorporates several refinements to the gunplay for a tighter and more intuitive gaming experience. The hipfire mechanics have been improved to ensure that the bullet trajectory will always align with the crosshair, and cone fire has been tweaked to more consistently cover the area within the crosshair. By request from our community, the backpacks have now been removed from all characters, so they will no longer clip through walls, vehicles or other objects. Several subtle changes have been made to the town map to improve the flow of gameplay. This includes the introduction of more infantry cover around the A1 and A2 control points, defensive positions in the church and the village area, and an additional anti-aircraft gun in the church tower. And last but not least, the US M3 half-track can now be painted in an olive drab and black camouflage scheme. That's all for now. Play the game for free at heroesandgenerals.com or on Steam.